welcome back to the channel so this is a continuation from that last vlog but um child oh i still got this sticky thing on my head anyways so nail school is cool you know like we have a new teacher we have a new teacher and we have a new teacher so she's trying to teach us uh some things um a lot of book work a lot of book work right with her even though we do book work in the uh other class she does the book work as well oh y'all see these nails watch out for them we go do them later but right now we have bird king with it we have bird talking about king the kids we can help you Hey, can I have a um so yeah I'm at Burger King. I need something on my stomach, so we gonna get this popping. And today I'm looking cute. Oh whatever. Y'all gotta see. Got the hat, match the bag, match the sneakers, okay? Oh y'all. If you are not subscribed to my channel, make sure you go ahead and subscribe right now. Um, also turn on that notification bell so that you'll be notified every time I drop another video. Today should be a fun day for me, but we'll see. I'm gonna be creating some crazy stuff. I don't know if you guys can see it already, but it has like little stars in it. I gotta finish shaping it and coloring it, etc, etc, etc. Whatever I'm gonna do to it, you know? Alright, y'all. So, I am now at the school oh my gosh the sun is like beating down anyways i'm at the school i'm about to go in first i'm about to eat the sandwich but before i go in i had to say this to y'all i don't know if you guys are into perfumes or if you guys like smelling like gold smelling like money i want to recommend this perfume to you guys libre by ysl it smells like class hunty okay get that girl get that leave them with your scent smell good ah! let me stop let me stop i'm bugging and it's too fucking early okay but i'm gonna go inside y'all look at this packaging like it is bottled up so beautifully do you guys see this oh hunty now you know that's of quality baby i would love to start making perfumes that'd be so cool hmm maybe that could be a workshop which i think this is fly okay and it smells so good i promise you
Hey YouTube, so obviously I stopped recording in the classroom because um, we do not have our normal teacher and this teacher is just a wee bit more stricter. So I stopped recording and I just wanted to show you guys my progress. As you can see, I'm using my nails like eh, eh, eh. But she is stricter, so I did not want to continue on with recording in there. I just wanted uh, to show you guys my progress. This is Friday now. <sighs> I have successfully made one month in this school. Starting next week, I go to the event side. And in the event side, I'm going to be learning more of what I am really trying to do. It's more of the hands-on. The first side, the pre-salon, is more so book work, but... The other advanced side is hands on. And as you guys can see, I have been doing my nails. Doo, 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 doo. So this one is like a cute orange amber looking color. So that when I put the gloss on top of it and I put it in the UV light, oh, that bitch gonna be shining. And then as for these, these are like a milk white and a clear together with some stars so that when I put that clear polish on top it's also gonna be looking flawless now as for this hand I'm working on this hand these two I'm making sure just because I need these two fingers to do a lot no it's this one I needed to do a lot so therefore I'm keeping it short with these two at least but listen ain't nobody gonna be stopping me from talking like this anyway so right now I'm on my lunch time and I'm trying to make sure that my plans for today flow. Flow like I needed it to. Um, like I said, it's Friday and I'm happy that it's Friday. Not that I'm going to be doing too much this weekend, but you know, like sometimes it's relief to know that you get to just chill for like two, two days. Two days out of five. Imagine that. Anyways, I will show you guys the uh, pictures and videos of my nails once they do come out. Um, if you are not following me on Instagram, my nail tech page, follow me now. Um, I'm going to continue doing these vlogs and I'm going to continue taking you guys on a journey. I do not see too many. I see some. I'm not going to lie. I see some nail tech journeys and... I just wanted to put my little shimmer into the nail tech world. You know what I'm saying? If you are new to the nail tech industry, don't um, hesitate to hit me up on Instagram at Gem Galore. That is my nail tech page or my personal page at BTs. I'm going to be putting them both on the screen for you so that you guys can just hit me up on Instagram at any time. I am here for you. Just know that, okay? And I want to see all my sis, all my good sis, to get up to a bag. Like, it's crazy because um, I went through something the other day that had me feeling kind of not discouraged because I'm sorry. Ain't nobody going to discourage me. <laughs> Nobody's discouraging me. And that's just period. <clears throat> story time. Quick story time before I go back to, to the uh, class. Oh, I might get Chick-fil-A. I don't know. So, the other day, I was promoting myself, I will say. I'm not even going to lie to you. I am promoting myself. I am adding a like, at least 50 to 100 girls a day on my Instagram because this is me trying to elevate my business or my future business. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get myself out there. So, I love following inspirational nail techs. Like, their work is so bomb, like bomb. And there was one particular person um, who I found very ugly. Like, I've never noticed how crazy this nail industry is until I got here. And there's a lot of ugly people out there. And there's a lot of, you know, cool, laid back people that want to see you win too. You know what I'm saying? People that understand and once knew that they once came from that. From the bottom exactly um starting with nothing you know what i'm saying um when coming into this industry at least so there was this specific girl i'm not gonna say no names because i'm not gonna give any clout like you don't deserve no clout of any type of sort such and she might be a cool individual and she might you know might have felt some type of way from it but i meant no harm 
But anyway, so I posted, she posted a cute little picture of uh, a set that she did. I said, these are bomb. Check out my nail page. Like, the heart emoji, eyes, and everything. You know what I'm saying? Like, I love your work. Check my work out. Like, tell me how am I doing. You see I'm a starter. You see I'm new to it. You know, you can easily, like, go sis. No. This girl writes, I really want to say B word, but I'm trying to watch my mouth and how I talk sometimes. But this B word, <laughs> she said, now why you think you comment on my page about your nail page? Okay, sis, first off, I complimented your picture and it's like, you just took complete offense to it. And it left me confused because I'm like, I went out my way to say, you're bomb. And you got upset because I said, check me out. Child, I would never ever get mad at any nail tech that comments on my stuff talking about check me out. I probably will check her out. And I'll probably ins like get inspired. I will probably get boosted in the head from seeing her work. You know what I'm saying? Yo, these di females, they different. And they think it's a competition. And it's like, I don't even see it as that. I do nails because I, genu I genuinely enjoy it. And I genuinely see a bag in it. And I genuinely see me doing big things with this nail industry like i do want to make my own acrylic uh, i do want to make my own glitters mixes there's a lot i want to do and it's like girl i am not letting the next female try to discourage me or make me feel any type of way for putting myself out there like travel please i'm about to go to the mall right now and pass out my business cards like ain't nobody stopping me I'm I'm motivated on another level. Like you can't, you can't. No. Eh, no. Not today, devil. Not today. Cause today ain't today. Uh. Anyways, I'm putting this camera away. I just wanted to say that. Um, I could have been ugly at the moment. I could have said some mean ish back. I could have came disrespectfully, but the way I let it slide for a little while. And I'm not going to lie, people got in my head. They were like, oh, you going to let her do that? And I'm letting them know, like, look, the blessed don't, don't, don't argue with the stress. The blessed don't argue with the stress. Because at the end of the day, guess what? You're blocking your blessings for even trying to play with these people or get on a level. I'm not blocking none of my blessings, boo, because I already blocked enough. And I'm not blocking anymore. And especially not for nothing stupid. You know what I'm saying? Like, let me block a blessing for my mama, for my kids, for my dad. You know what I'm saying? My family. I'm not blocking my blessings for others. Others that, you know, are nobody to me. You get what I'm saying with that? So, yeah, I'm not blocking my blessing for nobody, baby, because I need every little blessing I can get. Like, I feel as if God already pushed me and got me out of so much stuff for me to, like, just go back down some steps to go on her level. <laughs> we're better than that. And we're stronger than that. And we're not going to stop at every dog that barks. I don't do that. No. Nah. Yeah. No, no, no. It got to be a good ass reason for me to feel like I have to lower my vibrations for another person. Like, no, I'm up there. I'm still going to smile at you. I'm still going to like, yeah, because that's my heart. I'm not letting no nobody or nothing interfere with what I'm trying to do, with my vision, with my walk with God, with my attitude with myself, like my, this new me. I'm loving her. And you know what? All it was, all it took was a prayer. Like, I legit prayed God to renew my heart, give me a peace of mind. Yo, when I tell you my heart feels full, you feel me? I could be ugly all day, every day, but I choose not to be because why? There's so much other things to know that you are blessed about. Why be ugly? I would never understand it. Don't get me wrong. I was once one of those little teenager boppers that, you know, 
did the most and was just ugly and it's like over time you grow and you see how other people act and it just makes you want to be a better person and listen this is what my entire journey is about from nail tech from being a mother trying to be a better daughter trying to be better all around and then also my walk with God don't let nobody interfere with God if it wasn't sent from him sis don't even waste your time because oof Jesus you're gonna be going through it okay through it I hope y'all listening to what I'm saying listen up sis because I'm here I'm I'm here telling facts anyways I love you guys love you Alright, I'm done.